What's going on YouTube today? We have the best forward builds in NHL 25. I'm gonna give you three of my favorite and my squad's favorite forward builds. And we're gonna start with a Festive Fruits original. This playmaker has been one of my favorite throughout the past couple of days. It is absolutely elite, great at passing. And since those one-timers are so powerful, it's great having a good passing build. These builds are mainly gonna be used in threes and sixes. One of them is pretty powerful in ones also, but the first two builds I show you probably don't take them into ones. The last build you can't take into ones. All of them will work for threes and sixes. Since I don't wanna break down every single stat, I believe you guys can just copy some of this down. I'm gonna tell you what makes this build really good. First of all, as I talked about already, those one T's are very important. They're very powerful this year. So having someone to pass to those one-timer players is very nice and that's gonna be you if you rock this build obviously we have tape to tape on to help make our passes better but maybe they're not always open you can't pass it so you want unstoppable force do a little bit of skating shrug off some hits wait for your guys to get open maybe draw a double team pass it to open man that's what unstoppable force does for you we also have close quarters which just juices your scoring ability even more and it's some pretty nice snipes and as long as you're close enough. This can also increase your one-timer accuracy and shot and stuff. So it's, it's really nice. It's a really, really nice build. You're also rocking with 85 defensive awareness. I kind of made this build with center in mind. You can see I also have the face-offs up, but if you're not playing center, don't worry as much about defensive awareness. Don't worry about face-offs. Take those down, deking all the way up. Other than that, there's nothing else I want to talk to you about this build. Again, I'm not going over every single stat and ability. You can copy it all down. I will say, just a reminder, I said this in my last video. I'm going to say it in this video. The last time I say it, in tactics, play style, and technique, all three of these categories, you get a free 80 skill points. If you make a build by yourself, Never, ever, ever leave technique, play style, and tactics unchanged. You get free skill points. I repeat, free skill points. Next, let's hop into build number two. And the reason I'm so comfortable in calling these the best builds in season one is because they're not all made by me. This build is made by my club mate, my homie ISO, ISO Looney. A link to his Twitch is down in the description. He's pretty chill, but he's a really big sniper guy. And so he sent me over his sniper build. And of course, we have to put on the most broken way to score in this game right now, which is 1T. The one-timers are crazy. You can see he took that slop shot power and actually down, but it doesn't matter because they're so powerful and he has 1T. Speed kills, 95 speed, 95 acceleration. I'm not gonna do every single little thing about this build. I said that already, that's the last time I'll say it, but an important thing to know about this build is it is Primarily a wing build. You should run this at wing. You can run it at center. You're gonna have to take the deking down a little bit and centers come with inherently low deking. So running those snipers at wing can sometimes give you a bit of an advantage, but we do have agile deking on as a boost. So you can run this at center. Basically on defense for this build, just worrying about hitting those truculents, getting those big hits off on offense. You can, you know, do a little bit of dicing up with the puck. You can be an on puck player, but for the most part, you're going to be up in Ovi's office just ripping one tease. They're so fun, so effective this year. And that is build number two. The last build I'm going to show you guys was also sent in by a club mate. This is from Ghost. His link will also be down in the description. Go check him out. Super chill guy. We got a power forward here. This is the one where if you do want to build for ones, this also works extremely well for ones. It works in threes, it works in sixes. This is a great all around build. I showed you a build pretty similar to this last year and it's pretty much back. Unstoppable force in that gold zone ability as a power forward. You can go pretty small, pretty fast and get gold unstoppable force. It's a crazy, crazy, crazy combo to have along with 90 overall body checking that gives you great defense plus you have silver shutdown your poke check's gonna be better your blocking shots are gonna be better close quarters just gonna juice your scoring ability you can also replace this for a little bit of gray 1t if you want but i got it with close quarters for now you're also gonna see an 84 hand eye so if you want to get some tips that's completely possible with this build the last thing i'll talk about Deking and face-offs are up. If you're not playing at center, always bring that face-offs down, that deking up. 
Those are three of the best builds in NHL 25 season one. They all work in threes and sixes. This one specifically will be super elite in every single game mode you can play. If you guys want to see some great defensive builds, let me know down in the comments. Also, I'm going to start doing player builds, NHL player builds. So any NHL player you want me to make a build for, leave it down in the comments. I'll make the build, get some gameplay. It'll be sick. If you made it this far in the video, hit that sub button. Go to the first link in the description. Follow my Twitch. Follow everyone's Twitch. You need to do that. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. Festa Fruits, thank you for the prime sub.